Today I want to go over display expansion on the Google Ads search network. So one of the options they have when you're running search campaigns is called display expansion. And you may get a notification in your account that looks like this one down here. Use display expansion to get more conversions at a similar CPA with display expansion in one campaign. So if we click on view here, it'll bring us to our recommendation. So you may see use display expansion under your recommendations. And what I would say is I've always, always been a proponent of completely separating your search campaigns and your display campaigns. But the one positive with display expansion is it is a revamped Google Display Network feature saying it can help you get you additional conversions by using unspent search budgets at similar cost per conversion as search. Your overall budget cap will be observed and your spend on search will not be affected. So essentially what that means is if you are having trouble spending your daily budget on a daily basis, but you want to get more out of your Google Ads campaign, then display expansion may be for you, especially in niches that don't have a ton of volume or have a ton of competition because you may be able to drive less expensive clicks. And while you may not convert as well as you do on search with display expansion, those less expensive clicks will still convert over time. What they're saying down here is recommended because some of your search campaigns have unspent budget that could benefit from display display expansion. So that may mean that some days I don't have the ability to spend my full daily budget based on my targeting. Now I don't really have an issue with that in this account and my budget is pretty small to begin with. So they're recommending me display expansion. I think this is more for advertisers who are looking to get more out of Google ads. They have more budget to use and they're not able to spend their full budget. So what I would recommend first is if you do want to opt into display expansion, make sure you are targeting every relevant keyword for your business. Go back to your ad groups, go back to your website, make sure you're not missing out on any relevant keywords that may help you drive more clicks on a daily basis. Now, the one thing with display expansion, if we come over here to Google ads help just to go over how it works. So when we enable Google display expansion and you can do it right through the recommendations page here, you can see use display expansion, just click on apply all, and then that will use display expansion on our search campaign. But if we come over here, you can see you can enable display expansion by checking the display network option in the network settings card. So what we can do is if we do come back over to our Google ads account, you open up your campaign. So this would be a search campaign. And then under here for your settings under networks, what you can do is include the Google display network and that will be display expansion. Get additional conversions at similar or lower costs than search with unused search budget. Now in the past, I would always tell you not to do this, but if you are having trouble spending your budget, if you don't want to get more out of Google ads, then select it and see if it does help your campaign performance. The one thing to keep in mind is it will use the same exact settings for your bidding and your targeting that you currently have for the search network. Only unspent search budget will be used. Now, one thing to keep in mind is that your ads can appear when people search for terms on Google search and search partner websites that match your keywords. And they can also appear on relevant pages across the web on the Google Display Network. So what that means is if someone's searching for your search terms and then they're going across the Google Display Network, then your ads may show on relevant pages as people are browsing. Now, what Google is going to do is look at your search performance and try to show ads on the Display Network while, again, maintaining the average the same performance. So you do need to keep track of whether or not display expansion is working for you. And also make sure that you're using image ads. So in the ads and assets, make sure you're using image assets, formerly known as image extensions with your search campaigns. You don't need to do anything else to create new display ads. So my thoughts on display expansion, if we do come over here and come back into our recommendations tab, I would recommend applying this. If you do have a large budget, you're having trouble spending your full daily budget. You want to get a little more out of your campaign. In my case, where my budget is $5 a day, sometimes I set it up to $15, $20 a day if I'm testing. So if you're not spending a ton of money and you're not having an issue driving the amount of clicks and spending your full daily budget with search, then I wouldn't really recommend using display expansion. I would just recommend using it if you are having trouble spending that budget. So if you have any questions about display expansion, please leave them in the comments section. Thanks for watching my video today and make sure you subscribe to the Surfside PPC YouTube channel.